Hi, I'm Taka. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to introduce Yatsuhashi and Nama Yatsuhashi. Yatsuhashi is similar to a rice cracker, and just like the rice cracker, it's also hard. Yatsuhashi's main ingredients are rice flour, sugar, and cinnamon. The dough is then steamed and baked. It's shaped like the Japanese musical instrument, koto. Nama Yatsuhashi, on the other hand, is a soft type of Yatsuhashi, produced in the 1960s. Nama means raw. Unlike the Yatsuhashi that's baked, this one is steamed, so kids and aged people can also enjoy it. The triangle-shaped Nama Yatsuhashi with filling is very popular. The standard filling is usually red bean paste, but other flavors have emerged. You may find chocolate banana, strawberry, mango, and peach flavors. It's colorful and fun to see. Many Japanese think Yatsuhashi is Kyoto's standard delicacy. According to statistical research by Kyoto City in 2006, 96% of tourists bought sweets, and 45.6% of them bought Yatsuhashi and Nama Yatsuhashi. 24.5% bought Nama Yatsuhashi, while 21.1% bought Yatsuhashi. This data is surprising, because Kyoto has 25 Japanese sweet shops for every 100,000 people, and this record is the number one in Japan. There are many old Japanese sweet shops in Kyoto, but Yatsuhashi has made outstanding sales. In my opinion, many Japanese, especially young people, don't know much about old Japanese sweet shops, and they just pick up well-known delicacies like Yatsuhashi. My grandmother lived in Kyoto, and she always gave us a package of Nama Yatsuhashi every time she visited us. I also bought a box of Nama Yatsuhashi when I went on a school trip to Kyoto. Many junior high schools in Kanto area choose Kyoto for school trips because of its historical landmarks. And just like any other tourists, many students buy packages of Yatsuhashi because they see Yatsuhashi in souvenir shops and kiosks. The origin of Yatsuhashi is unknown, and there are some theories. One theory is that it originated from the father of koto music, Kengyo Yatsuhashi. There's a story that Mr. Yatsuhashi suggested to a manager of a tea house to make rice crackers using the leftover rice in the container with syrup and cinnamon. Four years after his death, this was in 1689, a sweet shop started selling the snack which was shaped like a koto. More than 14 companies produce Yatsuhashi, and they have different opinions about its origin. But we won't know for sure, since we don't have any concrete evidences. Nama Yatsuhashi was released in the 1960s, and it's more popular than the hard ones. It's soft and most of them have feelings. I'm going to introduce Yatsuhashi and Nama Yatsuhashi from Shogoin Yatsuhashi So Honten. The company started its business in 1689. The first one is Shogoin Yatsuhashi. The package contains 24 pieces and 3 individually wrapped pieces. It's 432 yen, about 3.55 US dollars. Allergen substance is soy. The second one is Koto no Haru. It means spring of the ancient capital. The package contains 10 pieces, 5 standard flavors and 5 green tea flavors. It's 594 yen, around 4.88 US dollars. Allergen substance is soy.
じゃあ早速八つ足食べていきたいと思いますまずは硬い方からいただきますいやこれねシナモンの香りがもうこの辺プンプンしてますすごいです私ね子供の頃はこの八つ足好きじゃなかったんですよもうねシナモンが苦手でダメでしたいこれはこれ結構硬いですすごいね甘いです甘くてシナモンの香りが結構効いてますねでねこれきな粉も入ってますねきな粉の味もしますなんかシナモンと砂糖の味が合わさってちょっと黒糖っぽいような感じもします結構個性が強いんで好みが分かれると思いますはい、じゃあ今度は生八つ足いただきます中にあんこが入ってますこれは硬い八つ足ほど日記は効いてないですうん生地が柔らかいこれ生地が柔らかくて中に粒あんが入ってて美味しいです人気があるのもうなずけますはいじゃあ次は、えっと、抹茶ですねグリーンティーフレーバーいただきますあ抹茶が食べた途端に抹茶の味が口で広がりますこれがねまた抹茶と粒あんがよく合いますわこれもね美味しいですまあ、この生八つ足はまあ、日記が苦手でなければなんですけどまあ、お土産で買ってっても喜ばれると思います今日は八つ足と生八つ足の食レポでしたご視聴ありがとうございました。Today I introduced Yatsuhashi and Nama Yatsuhashi.Let me know which one you feel like trying and sound off in the comment section below.Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't.Thank you so much for watching my video.I'll see you in the next one. またね。